Alright, what is going on guys, Frazier or K here and welcome back to a brand new type of video to my channel. I have been seeing so many illusions, especially on Facebook recently. My friends have been really into illusions recently, like we've all been looking at them and just tripping out on them, they are so interesting. And today I have finally decided to collect up all of these sick ones that I have found, mostly through my friends, but I have found some really cool illusions and I want to show you guys in this video. Okay, everybody watching this video right now, if you enjoy it and you want me to make another one, I want you to right now scroll down and leave a like on this video. Leave a like and let's smash over 10,000. This is the first time I've ever made an optical illusion video. I find them so interesting and I definitely would like to do another one. But if you guys smash over 10,000 likes, I will make it happen sooner. Because I have been sitting here just watching all these illusions like in my Sony Vegas. Just watching them back for you guys. Like just making them, getting it already. I've seen like five in the past ten minutes. And my eyes right now feel like weird. Like my eyes don't feel normal. Okay, so what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to show you guys an optical illusion. And I'm going to show you what happens when I do it. So you can see how I do it. And then I'm going to play it for you guys afterwards so you can do it yourself. The first thing I would recommend you guys do now is to make this video full screen. Just press the full screen button. If you're on your phone, make sure it's like sideways full screen because that's how you get the best effect from looking at these illusions. These illusions that you're going to see as well are only temporary. Like people watching this don't feel like, you know, you're going to look at something on your screen and trip out for the rest of your life. That would be sick, but we can't do that. I'm just kidding. That would not be sick. Imagine seeing, well, you guys don't know what you're going to see. You might know, but I know what you're going to see and I would hate to have that kind of vision for the rest of my life. I would just go crazy. The first time I actually saw this illusion, I think I was in school, like it was that old, but I've just seen it resurfacing at Facebook recently. Like I've seen so many on Facebook. Okay, this first illusion is called the Beyonce illusion. There are a few kind of Beyonce illusions. You guys might have seen one, or I've seen one where you look at like this, this thing like Beyonce, then you look at a wall and you just see Beyonce on the wall. Like you just see her there. It's really, really weird and really trippy and really cool. And I found one that is kind of different but you guys can do it just straight up from looking at this video at the screen right now so what you need to do is what, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do it first like I said then you guys can do it after so you've got to look at this this right here is Beyonce you can see her on the right there's three dots on her nose and I'm going to sit here I think for like 30 seconds or so and just look at the red dots my eyes aren't gonna move I'm just gonna look at the red dots and then a white screen will appear up after about 30 seconds or so I said so then a white screen will appear up and you will see Beyonce there there will be nothing on that screen you can have somebody sitting next to you if you want for proof there will be nobody nothing on that screen Nothing at all, but you will see Beyonce and you will see a colored version. This is like the inverted like negative or whatever kind of version this is. Can't really remember what kind of filter that is called. I remember having that filter actually on my, uh, you know, my old Nokia taking photos with the boys on the bench. Looking sick with that filter. I don't know if any of you can throw it back like that. <sighs> okay, I'm ready to do this. I will not break eye contact. You cannot break eye contact. I'll keep this, you know, face cam here so you guys can see me obviously. Um, but yeah, I'm ready to trip out. Oh no. Let's go. I'm doing it. I'm not breaking eye contact. Just try and mimic what I do. So I'm playing it first for you guys to see. So you don't like make any mistakes. So you can definitely trip out essentially. First try. This is so weird. It's like strains your eyes after a while. I've done it so many times in the past few minutes. Alright. It should be coming up soon. I'm starting to feel weird. <laughs> oh, there she is. There's Beyonce. I'm legit looking at Beyonce. I'm looking at her. She's got like a shiny brown face, brown, black hair, whatever she has. I can still see her just. And now she's gone. I just saw a Beyonce that was not there. Do you guys want to try it? I'm going to play that for you now so you can have the full effect. I won't be here talking, chatting. You can just do it yourself. I'll play some more throughout this video. Don't worry. I have some more sick illusions. This is only the first one. Get ready. I'm going to play it for you guys right now.
How weird was that? I bet you guys now are like, whoa, okay, like, I didn't expect it to be like that, because that's what my first reaction was. The first time I saw that coloured in Beyonce, the real life looking Beyonce, just from looking at three dots on a weird thing's nose, like, I don't know how that works, but it is mental what your mind and your eyes can do, and how they can play tricks on you. And your eyes and mind are about to play some more tricks on you. Well, it's about to happen to me first. I'm going to do it, show you guys how to do it and what to do. It's really simple. All you do is literally look, but you guys are going to see my reaction first and see me get a bit freaked out. So this next optical illusion is the one that my friend showed me actually earlier today. That is the reason why I'm making this video. I saw this and I was like, okay, I have to show you guys this because it is crazy. It looks like my hand is like moving and I have like kind of bubbles on my hand sometimes. Some people see like, but my friend Ryan, like his hand like comes out like that sometimes. Like it's, it's like wavy. It's not even just your hand as well. Your hand's probably the weirdest place to look at though because it's your hand. Like why would your hand be moving when your skin is just, you know, still? Why would it be all wobbly? I can't explain the full effects of what like it is until you guys do it yourself. Again, I recommend you play it on as big a screen as you can, full screen even on your phone and please do just stare straight in the middle. You guys are allowed to blink if that's something you are thinking you can you know blink and stuff uh, don't look away though i'm gonna try it now but right, i'm gonna get a bit closer to my screen for this as you guys should too just you know don't like put your phone to your face if you're on your phone like that make it so you can still see but so it's like covering most of your vision um okay i'm gonna get ready here we go i mean there's no point in you just watching me just watch something so i'll speed this up for you guys right now I swear I'm seeing red lines, like I'm seeing red lines now and like they weren't there before but they just started popping up. Okay, this is really weird, uh, it's not even over and I'm tripping out just by looking at this. Oh, this needs to stop. What? Oh my god, oh my god, my hands, my skin of my hand is moving, it is wobbly, <gasps> this is so weird, it's not just there, you can look at my, de my desk is moving, my desk is moving, and my keyboard moving, my keyboard's moving, oh, <gasps> my camera lens, go slightly, the effects are wearing off slightly now, but, Oh my god. Okay, I think it's kind of I think it's kind of wearing off now. It lasts for a little bit. On some people it lasts a lot longer. It depends how long you look at it for as well and how intensely, but Am I still tripping out? No, I think I'm good now. So that was what happened to me. You just saw what I did, what I looked at. That is what you guys can do when you experience this. I'm gonna play the clip for you now. Just remember what I said, you can blink, make your screen full screen. Just look at it as closely as you can without being too close. Look at so central. Don't break eye contact with it. Good luck and I hope you guys do enjoy this.
So that was crazy, right? Your hand, you just saw your hand and anything else you looked at essentially move and wobble. That was a really weird feeling. I have one more to show you guys. Nothing too eye straining, like no spirals and made meg. I don't know what I was just trying to say then. There's going to be no spirals and crazy shit. I'm going to play you guys the Jesus Optical Illusion. You are going to see Jesus on your wall. So you see that wall behind me? I'm going to watch something for 40 seconds. Not even watch. I'm just going to look at a picture for 40 seconds. I'm going to turn around. You guys aren't going to see it. But I'm going to see Jesus Christ on that wall right there. Okay, are you ready? Let's do this. So this illusion is a little bit different to the other ones we have watched. The way you actually see the hallucination is after you stare at the dots in the middle of the picture for the duration of the video, you look at your wall or you look at like a clear thing, like a desk, like anywhere that's just like plain. Look at that and start blinking. Just start blinking like that. Do that at anything that's like plain, and that is when you will see the illusion. The illusion will blink up there to you. It is really, really weird. I just did it to test it, and I just I, I just still can't believe that actually worked that clearly. So let's do this. Okay. I'm gonna stare at these dots for the duration of the video, and I'll speed this up, and I'll be tripping out at the end. Right, I've got to get the camera ready to hold some vlog so you guys can see what I'm about to see. Well, you're not going to see it, but you're going to experience it with me. Okay, I'm looking at this wall. I see Jesus right there. I'm blinking. This looks so, this is probably the trippiest kind of video I've ever made. Look at, I'm literally seeing him. I can see his eyes, his mustache, his hair. Like if I if I had a pen, I could literally colour him in right now. I could colour Jesus in. I could still see it. I'm going to go for as long as I can. For as long as I can still see it. So you guys can see how long this actually lasts for. I can still see it faintly. Definitely a lot fainter now. Like, it's just right there. That is so weird. You guys are going to experience this right now as well. Ever so faintly. Nah, he's... Is he still there? Am I just tripping out now as Jesus in my wall? But like, it's not nowhere near as defined now. Like, I can't really make out his mouth and beard difference, which you could either. You can literally see his whole beard. By the way, my Movember is is awful. Like, I don't grow facial hair. I'm not sure if I should keep this or not. Can you guys let me know in the comments if I should keep this? Sorry to get so sidetracked, but the the talk of beards and shit is just it puts me off. God damn it! Let me know if I should keep this or not, guys. I need to know. Um, but yeah guys, that is going to be the end of my first optical illusion video. My eyes are actually a really bit strained right now because I was testing loads of illusions out before then I just recorded them all again for this video and then my eyes feel a bit weird. I might just go shut them for like 10 minutes or something. But if you guys did enjoy this, please do remember to leave a like. Let's please smash over 10,000 likes and I will do another optical illusion video. Subscribe if you are new. I will make these videos again. I also make other videos. I do loads of like challenges, pranks, vlogs. I'm going to be doing a skit soon, which you guys are going to enjoy. It's actually going to be really funny. I've actually thought of a good idea for it. But yeah, have a great rest of your day. This has been Fraser or Face K, and I'll catch you guys in my next video tomorrow. Peace out, everybody.